We tried some more football hospitality, this time at the London Stadium, home of West Ham United. Today's match was versus Aston Villa and we arrived in East London about three hours before kickoff and made our way to the club store. Spent a bit of time having a look at the Claret and Blue merchandise, then it was off to the Club London hospitality entrance. Everything looking very smart as we made our way in, then it was to the reception to pick up our tickets. Tickets in hand, we then scanned them at the turnstiles. We then asked a staff member to take us to the hospitality lounges, which were upstairs and past some London 2012 memorabilia. And for today's hospitality, we were in the Great Britain Lounge. Welcomed by staff who also gave us a hospitality wristband on entry. Wristband on, it was then into the stunning lounge, which does have a smart casual dress code and feels quite informal once you're inside. Allocated tables and seats and waiting for you on your seat is a match day programme. Time for a drink, so we made our way up to the paid bar. A good choice of beer, wines and soft drinks at the bar, which you can order all afternoon and enjoy inside the lounge. Took our drink back to the table, then checked out the food menu. Shortly afterwards, there was table service for starters, and on this occasion, it was soup with bread. Polished off the starters, then for the main course, you make your way up to the food counters. And a good idea to get your main course early on to avoid any queues. And for the main course, it was a carvery. A couple of chefs behind the counters to cut up and serve the meats, which looked very good. Moving down the food counter, everything looked amazing, from Yorkshire puddings to roast potatoes and vegetables. Made sure our plates were loaded up with a bit of everything, and that did include a generous serving of very tasty gravy. Enjoyed lunch back at the table whilst watching the early kickoff. Then hopefully after your main course, you're still hungry because there is a good selection of fruit, cakes, and desserts. And because I do have a sweet tooth, I went for a cupcake and a huge donut. And before making your way into the stand for the start of the match, remember to fill out your score prediction. Also before the match, there was a Q&A with some former players, including Carlton Cole. Then with about 10 minutes to go until kickoff, it's a good idea to grab yourself a hot drink, especially on the colder days. And a bit like the food, there are a few good options, including coffee and hot chocolate. And it's a good idea to leave the lounge about 10 minutes before kickoff at least, to avoid getting caught up in any of the pre-match rush. There is a short walk from the lounge with direct access to the lobby and the double doors, which do lead out into the stand. Seats are located in the West Stand and there are a few sets of steps to make your way up. A good idea to check your e-ticket to make sure you know where you're going and then it's to your allocated padded seat ready for the start of the match. And match day tickets inside the Great Britain work out to be £189 per fixture for the 21-22 season. And finally a question for you guys, where should we go for the next padded seat?